Hey guys, and welcome to, uh, more vampire. I am continuing where we left off yesterday, and I am going to go through the cemetery. I was just looking here, so I didn't realize that as, like, you play, and it's probably been like this forever, and I just didn't see it, but I have new dialogue options. It tells me when I have new dialogue options for something. Oh, okay, so I'm going to click on it. But for Dr. Swansea and for, um, well, Ashbury, Lady Ashbury, it, for the reason, the stupid thing don't, won't let me go to it. Oh, I didn't want to do that. There we go. Uh, okay, that's just my high down stuff too. So we're going to go talk to them first, and then we're going to go over here and try this godforsaken boss fight <laughs> and probably die a million thousand times um but first let's get through the thing here i'm almost positive because okay all the other graves are completely covered right so it was this one i don't think so though it looks like it's concrete this was our sister's grave right and it's been, like, knocked into. Did she become a vampire? Um, he's not commenting on it, so maybe I'm overthinking it. And it's been too long since we played that section for me to remember, honestly. But, uh, I'm always positive that's where our sister was at. Where am I even at? Am I close? Yeah, I'm going the right way. And slowly but surely starting to understand this the map of this game a little bit better. I think. Yeah. So I can Would you So thank you for the opium. <laughs> okay, and I got some more guys over here. It's not gonna hurt for me to attack and get some stuff. I do like that this takes um uh, excuse me? Why are you dragon shouting me? Get off me. Hmm. I was gonna say, maybe they're getting a little tougher, but I'm also using a slightly weaker weapon than before, but it's because it's faster and it does the blood sucking for me. <laughs> so, let's do that. Because I wanted to be able to use that uh, shotgun. Alright, down. Here, I think. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, we're good. And then these guys will probably be back, but I, they're really not that bad anymore. Is that money? Oh, no, it's a plant. <laughs> it looks like the gold is usually, like, the shillings that are usually sitting around. Yeah, here, there you are. Yeah, I like that that it does the blood sucking for me, kind of. There we go. Dude, stop. Okay. I guess we could just go down this way instead of having to go around like I always do. I do that because that one time I got killed right there. 
that was just kind of annoyed, so I just started going around. Hello. Don't mind me. I don't know why they just straight up attack me. I don't know how they know I'm a vampire, other than the fact that I'm walking around at night. Unless it's unless it is because of my eyes. But I feel like that wouldn't really matter. Gosh. Oh my gosh, what is your... There we go. Pick up all your stuff. Oh, and I also looked up um, where to get a good handle part, because I'm like, why can't I find a good handle part so I can upgrade my weapon? And it's simple, it's because apparently parts only become available after certain chapters. And guess what? Good handle part does not come available until much later on. Well, much later on. I think the next chapter. So, what weapon I, weapons I have, I should be able to use to defeat these people. Basically. Um. And... Let's... Um. Okay, so I want to go talk to... Edgar and Lady Ashbury. Let's see if Eh, we can Who's got what going on with them today? I still don't know what's wrong with you. And you have neuralgia. I don't know where he's at, though. Everybody else is healthy. Oh, well, that's good. Oh, so, and also another thing. Oh, hey, Sarah, and thank you. Yes, my hair has grown quite a lot. <laughs> uh, I guess it has. it is a lot longer than you remember seeing it, and la yesterday it was pulled back. Um, so I keep on remembering, keep on finding this, like, item in my bag. I don't know if I can find it now. And I'm like, oh, this is somebody's, like, item I need to return. It's actually... Yeah, it's that. It's, uh, it's, it belongs to the guy I killed at the beginning. <laughs> Oops. And at this point, I've actually played it to the point where I probably, I shouldn't have killed him. But I was just like, well, I'm a vampire. I want to know what, what that's like. So, well, well, whatever. Uh, anyway. So, but he's got neuralgia. I don't remember who that is. I don't even know who you are. Like, I haven't even met you. I don't even know how that's possible. Everybody here is not doing so hot. I'm not going there anyway, so they're just going to have to deal with not being doing so hot. So I got cold, cold, sepsis, migraine, fatigue, 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 fatigue. Okay. Oh, well, they're going to have to deal with me making my stuff first. There we go. Um, okay, I don't have enough for that. Ooh, I'm out of a lot of uh, hydrochloride for everything, huh? Go ahead and make cold. I'll make a second headache medicine. Don't have enough for migraine. Okay. Everybody else is just kind of SOL there. And... Yeah, I want to use that, but I really need to be able to... Mm. I really need to be able to use the gun, because I've got, I've got a really powerful right at this point, and I've got a lot of bullets. <laughs> I think I maybe need to refill? Let me see. Uh... I guess I it is refilled. Okay. Cool. Um. Alright, let's go talk to Edgar, because he should be in his office. Oh, Eddie! It says I have dialogue options. Hello! Jonathan, have you got any news about Sean Hampton? I'm still investigating. In the meantime, I have some questions. All right, just ask. Mm. Uh, a vampire made of blood. 
How did you meet Lady Anne? I guess I can probably ask Tell all me, of them. Edgar, have you ever heard about a vampire made of blood? I mean, without any physical form, but a shape of blood. What are you talking about? Uh, have you seen such a phenomenon You're yourself? talking about, like, my no. maker? I was just daydreaming. Since blood seems to be the key of our existence, I imagined what could be the ultimate state of a vampire. Hmm. I see. Well, too bad you didn't see such a creature. I think it was just it us seeing our maker and he was, like, talking to us. He probably has some sort of connection with us, considering. What is the antagonism between your brotherhood of St. Paul Stoll and the guard of Prewen? It is an old and sad story, Jonathan. The story of a betrayal and of a definitive schism. Uh, okay, who, who betrayed, betrayed who? who? I suppose each side would tell you the fault lies with the other. This I know for sure. A long time ago, members of the Brotherhood chose to hunt down vampires. Oh, okay. How many are That's you it. in the Brotherhood? <laughs> you mean today? Uh, not many. A dozen, perhaps even less since the war. We are scholars, Jonathan. We favor quality to quantity. Okay, fair enough. And how Tell do you know me, Lady Edgar, Ashbury? How did you meet Lady Ashbury? My... Wife. I met her nine years ago. <laughs> Not yet, but will be. I was working in Scotland at the time in a sanatorium the good lady visited from time to time. She subsequently offered me a position here at the Pembroke Hospital. Hmm. Why offer you this position? I'd already been experimenting with bloodborne diseases and transfusion methods. Without success, I'm afraid. How could I refuse such a fascinating creature? <laughs> so, in 1911, I took charge of the Pembroke. Okay. Pembroke Hospital. Why that name? I'm not quite sure. I think it's meant to refer to the Earl of Pembroke. Perhaps it's someone she used to know? Hmm. Okay. Tell me, Edgar. Have you ever heard about a vampire made uh, I mean, without any physical form, but a shape of blood. Oops, we got a glitch here. <laughs> it repeated dialogue instead of going to the next, to saying what he was actually saying. Whatever. It still got me out of the conversation. Was that something I could... Can I steal anything else from your office there, buddy? Doesn't look like it. Okay, uh, we'll go down and talk to Lady Ashbury then. My beautiful redhead. Ooh. Items for me, thank you. You're still looking at this body. It's been there for quite a few days there, honey. How are you this evening, Jonathan? The scowl that escaped from the hospital is eluding me. He must be caught. Scowls are a risk to the balance we maintain. It needs to be stopped. Okay. The head of the guard of Prewen stopped by to see Dr. Swansea. You have nothing to fear. The guard would not risk openly challenging the Brotherhood. Even they are not that Could you, foolish. Can like, not look off into the distance and look at me? Thank you. Uh... Now that the hunters are aware of my presence, they could discover your whereabouts, too. Don't worry. I've evaded those jackals in the past, and I shall do so in the future. And besides, who would ever suspect the kind Samaritan Lady Ash? You were already blackmailed once. <laughs> they already I found you out no once. I love lost between the Brotherhood and the Guard. They share the same fascination in our species. But they diverge from any commonality in thought. Talk to Dr. Swansea if you wish to know more. Okay. Uh. You certainly hate skulls. I mean, no. They're kind of like. Oh, not yeah. hate. I was gonna say, they're I just like animals. Them. Damaged and but even worse. For eternity. Can you imagine? Like jackals Jonathan? almost. Can you imagine what they must be suffering? Do you think they can be trusted? 
They are weaker than us in every sense. From their abilities, to being able to control their hunger. There is a savagery in them. Hmm. I would not have labeled them all the same. I've met some that are quite clever, in fact. Much like people. I am sorry. You should know Scal is derived from slave. Vampires have never looked kindly on their lesser progeny. Ugh. Well, that's kind of harsh. I mean, I get it, but because, you know, when we were they don't really funeral, act human, most of them. I had a feeling. I think I met my maker. You do not have to tell me if you don't wish to. Uh... Should I not? In most circumstances, a vampire would not discuss his maker. There is a strong bond that exists between a maker and their progeny. Mm. Okay. There is almost nothing to say. He appeared in a gush of blood, prattled off some riddles, and vanished without even telling me his name. Be on guard, Jonathan. Whoever your maker is, he's obviously as powerful as he is elusive. Okay. I mean, I kind of gathered that. Goodbye for now, my lady. Okay. <laughs> that one at least didn't glitch out on me. So now, does that mean I have... I have. I, see, I didn't even know that. Learn something new every day. Didn't realize those little exclamation marks meant, like, new. I'll have to keep an eye out for those from now on. Event. Noted. Um, ugh, now I gotta go all the way back down this way and deal with all these jerks. Okay. Is this a trash can? Oh, I can. <laughs> Should never be that excited about digging through a trash can, but here we are. I never realized, like, how important, like, crafting and stuff is until much later in a game. It seems like every game I've ever played, I always, like, do that. I don't think it's important until it's important. Okay, every side Best is the same. Be moving on. Steady boys. Yeah. Oh, using my, using my crucifix. Come on. Thank you. like enough here. I hate when they shoot at me because it hurts. Thank you for dying. Okay. Grab all y'all stuffs. Hmm. I don't know if I've ever came out this way. May not hurt to look around a little bit, huh? Never mind. I don't feel like dealing with all these people because I'm not going to be able to, uh... Well, I mean, I can save. Okay, that's just a thing calling for volunteers. Oh my gosh. I need to go across that bridge. Step away, stupid bitch! Oh gosh. And come on, go down. Then it's six. There we go. Whew. I 
get curious if I can give that ring to um, Edwina, Clay's wife. So yeah, whenever I was looking that up yesterday, I was like, what do I do with this this um, thing I found? And then come to find out it's like the guy I killed and his wife is that one woman, Edwina, who was cheating on him anyway, so whatever. Didn't seem to really care about him, but she probably would care if she knew I was the one who killed him, I'd imagine. Probably one of those things that's like all like honor or something, since he was part of the wet boot boys. Ooh, some stuff over here. Where am I? Oh, so I could go down there. I don't want to do that though. I don't want to make a big circle around. Mm. It would be, it would behoove me. Yeah, let's go around this way. Just out of curiosity. I'm sure I'm going to run into some either scowls or something, but. never really a safe place to go. I hear a train. Oh, that has been unlocked. Nice. Oh, okay, so I am at the docks now. Cool. He has a cold, so let's go ahead and give him some medicine. You again. What do you want? Oh, calm down. Do you need medical help, sir? Yeah, I do. If you can throw in some drugs, I can find use for that too. So you can sell them on the black market? Sorry. I'll only provide you with exactly what you need. Fair enough, Dr. Reed. That cost me nothing to ask. Yeah, I think I've already asked you everything. Except the one, which I can't do anything about. Goodbye, Mr. Dickey. All right. And I think, nope, she's healthy. Just out of curiosity, can I give her the ring? Good evening, Miss Cox. Hello again, Doctor Reed. What do you want? Hmm. Can I see what you have to sell? As long as you have money, I'll show you all I have. Okay. Just... Yeah, if I sell that to her, I feel like that'd be bad. Yeah, we'll sell that. I'll have to look it up, what happens if I happen to sell that to her. Because I got a funny feeling she would probably throw it just a bit. Okay. Um... Everybody around here should be fairly healthy now, because I did take care of a lot of issues. Um, this poor dude over here probably still has sepsis, so let's see if I can take care of him. Evening, Rufus. Oh my. Evening, Mr. Reed. I Do you need help? Think I made a thing for sepsis? A real doctor caring about me. That's the first. I feel like a real person. Ugh, I don't have it. Sorry. I'll see you later. So long, Rufus. Be careful. Take care. Sorry about that, dude. Can I do it right now? Okay, whatever. Hey, Milan! <laughs> Oh, he has a cold, so let's give him some medicine. I just gave you medicine the other Good day. Evening, Mr. Fishman. Yeah, yeah. Do you require medical assistance? <laughs> That's something I didn't expect to hear again. A doctor concerned with the health of his patients. Yeah. I could use some help. On several matters, in fact. Okay. I don't know medicine. which kind of doctor you're used to dealing with. But it's a doctor's purpose to heal people. And is it your purpose as well, Mr. Reed? 
I would say it's a convenient way for gaining people's trust. Okay, I don't think I can ask you anything else because I pretty much unlocked all your stuff. So I just have that one I have to unlock. Goodbye, Mr. Fishburne. But I don't know how I do that. How's your mother doing? You still got sepsis. Sorry, can't do anything for you. And she's healthy. Good. Uh, let's go up here. And you're still good. Come on, let me go. There we go. So I need to change some things there. What do I need for sepsis? As uh, a sodium hypochlorite or whatever. Good lord, I need 15 of those for that? That's ridiculous. Okay. I kind of wonder if it would behoove me to save here. Probably would. Let's go ahead and do that, just to be on the safe side. Okay, I can't really upgrade anything, so confirm. The following night. Yeah, they're not doing so hot over there, but... Eek, it's in serious, okay. Still stable. And I haven't been there yet. Totally fine. Nope, that's <laughs> that's where I'm headed <laughs> to go beat up the big dude. Uh I'm hoping that now I'm at level 15, that I did a little bit of weapon adjusting, maybe? Th maybe I'll be lucky. <laughs> and I did up my health and stamina yesterday, so... Okay. Oh, these guys. Every time. Alright, that's fine. Got him. Nice. Okay, that goes out there. Then we'll go through here. Deal with this jerkwad again Burn for the hundredth time. I didn't need to heal. That's okay. Can I? Oh, there it goes. Took a second. Okay. Um. I might have medicine for you, actually. Good evening, Mr. Throckmorton. Dr. Reed, can I be of any assistance? Have you noticed anything suspicious lately? Do you need my medical attention, sir? Actually, I may. In my line of work, I have to stop at any sign of infection. All right. 
Treating a vampire hunter's wounds is certainly a first for me. <laughs> I'm happy to help you, of course. Thank you, Dr. Reed. Your support means a lot. Still can't ask any new things, can I? Goodbye. Nope. I think I messed and that up hunting, anyway. Mr. Throckmorton. Probably just by not telling him off. But I just wasn't that concerned, honestly. Um... Where? Okay, she has fatigue. Uh, why are we loading like this? Uh oh. Glad to see you oh, again, whew, Mr. Okay. Reed. Usually it doesn't do that. Do you need my medical attention, Miss Paxton? I can keep going, Dr. Reed. Of course you can, Miss Paxton. But I wouldn't recommend it. Please, take this. You will feel better. Thank you, Dr. Reed. Thank you. Really. Goodbye, Miss Paxton. Okay. Where is your sister? Because I think she's needing some medication as well. That's Ichabod. Lottie. Yeah, we know he's fine. He's a vampire. What does he care? You know, do I have an area that's just like nothing? I mean, I get it it's for like to make the world bigger, but like at least put something back there. Oh, there she is. She has a headache. I might have medication for that, I think. And she's drinking. No wonder you have a headache. You again. What do you want? Do you need medical help, Miss Paxton? I may, but I have no money for your scams, Doctor. I don't charge patients. My scam is much more subtle than that, Miss Paxton. All right, then. <laughs> yeah, thank you, Doctor. But don't think I take you for an ally of the working class. Yeah, well, sure. Well, I'll leave you for now. Goodbye, Miss Paxton. And I know the other reason for healing somebody is because it will, like, if they're not healthy, then their blood quality is down. So if you drink from them, then it kind of, you're not going to get much from them or as much from them. But also, I'm doing it because I know uh, that the areas will fall into, like, chaos, as they put it. Uh, if I don't... Oh, that is shining. Oh, it's a light shining off of that. Okay. And, uh, yeah, anyway, that's the reason I heal people. And I will say, I admit, I did consider, actually, um, to get my points up a little bit. Killing that one, like, evil priest guy. He was, like, burning people. But, after... I looked it up and he's like, he's level 5 mesmerized and I think I'm only level 3 or level 2, actually. So, they make it a lot harder for you than just, yeah, here's a bad person. Don't feel bad if you kill him. Okay. So, I need to go... Oh, it's back over that way, I remember now. Ooh, what's up here? Anything? I think I've been up here before, actually. I can't believe I'm doing this. Any other, uh, helpless little things? Okay. No. I've been in this house, right? Yeah, I have been. all that important then. Oh, I can take that though. Um, okay, so I kind of go around 
here. I'm going to run into some guys, probably. I think I ran into some guys yesterday. Yep, right here. Best be on your way home. Over there! <laughs> Okay. Wish there was a faster way to get around, but here we are. And back in. Okay. I'm about to do that, uh, if you want to call it a puzzle again, or if it's just already done, since I did do it. Okay. Uh, while I'm down here, let's go ahead. And yeah, this one. That way it's up there on my screen whenever. Yeah, okay. I guess I'll probably come back around that way at some point. Yep, I've already. Okay, good. It already remembers that I did this. Not that it was a big deal, it would take me two seconds to do it again, but it's nice that it doesn't, like, just completely reset. I'm gonna turn that on so I can see the rats here in a second. Because I want to be full on blood. I need to change what medications or whatever things I have. Yep, there they are. Hi there, little guys. Sorry, little guys. This is despicable. I have this. Okay, we're good. Thirst for blood. Now, I guarantee I will die a few times. But. <laughs> we will do our best. Okay. You shall learn to respect the laws of Ascalon! Alright. Okay, so the thing I read was to make sure I just stay healthy. Oh, I didn't change the... that's okay. okay. Stay away from him. Ooh. Oh, I hate those things. Oh, I need to... Am I out of bullets? Oh, I didn't realize. Oh my gosh. Oh, okay. Well, at least I didn't waste any of my medications. So we're just going to do this until I beat it. Return to your apothecary and needles. Where are you? Ha. I shall crush you. No! Get off of me! No! Okay. Huh. <laughs>
<laughs> yes, I did. I did do that, Ace. <laughs> well, I'm going to have to run back to... So, here's the deal. <laughs> I am already at a point where I can't... Um get like the pacifist ending because I killed the very first guy that it could have been so <laughs> my option here is is to kill a citizen and frankly at this point I'm willing to do it because I'm kind of tired of this um, back and forth oh man it took it didn't give me all my bullets back that time usually I have six on me okay that sucks. But I'm getting better. That's the main thing here. <laughs> I hate that I'm going to have to do this, but I'm getting really tired of chasing around and not being able to beat anything. But I will do what I must. And I do have a particular murderer in my midst, so I will go after him. If I can, that is. You guys deal with your buddy. I wish these people counted, but they don't. Oh, I just now realize he's a level 17, so you think. Come on, go down. At this point, I'm just trying to get rid of you guys because I'm down. Thank you. Alright. Back into town. Okay, I'm not going to hurt anybody around here. Matter of fact, I'm going to up here. And where is the bullet thingy magic? There it is. I am assuming that filled me up. sturdy sample can't make this though okay good at least I got that up and to look up people. I don't know if I can five, four. I don't know if I can or not. Enid. I'm not going to kill Enid. Three. Can go after Dyson, and he is just a drunk. I hate doing that. I'm not gonna hurt you guys either, or you. Don't know about you yet, and I'm not gonna hurt these ladies. What other people are there? I know this is awful. Like, who can I eat? Okay, um, not hurting you guys. Could, but I'm not going to. Were you? You're. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not gonna hurt anybody there.
Harry Peterson. He's a five. That's such BS. <laughs> because he's like, he sucks. Um, and I think they do that on purpose because they're like, yeah, we know you're going to go after the really crappy people and leave the really nice people alone. Huh, Dorothy's not very high, but I'm not going to hurt her either. Wait, where does this go? Does that go straight across there? Yeah, we'll go this way for a change. Lock dock. That is locked. Oh, this is the way I came earlier in the game. Okay. Steady, got one out. Ooh, you guys are tough. He really took a bite out of me. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna die. Because I'm being stupid. You know what? Let's get out of here. That was a waste. Guys are really This guy drops the. There we go. Watery brisk blood sample. Oh, okay. Usually it's a sturdy sample, isn't it? Okay. Alright. Sorry, Dyson. Not the vacuum. <laughs> I'm gonna have to... Where's he at? He is in there. I'm really sorry about this. Like, super sorry. Like... <laughs> Good evening, Mr. Delaney. What? Ah, oh, you're that doctor. <laughs> yeah, I'm a level two and he's a level one, so I can do this. Oh, Let's go out back here. Oh, gosh, we gotta go mild just to kill you. <laughs> there it is. Okay. Sorry. Sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. I don't have a choice. Mm. 
no one will ever know what I did. I'm gonna die with blood on my hands. Oh, he was a murderer anyway. No one will remember me. Suffer the song, man. I know, I know, I know. I'm a terrible person. I'm, <laughs> I'm really sorry. <laughs> I get it. Awful. <laughs> I don't like killing people in these games. Okay, so I have 1,180 XP now. Okay. Was there anybody else that was like easy <laughs> I think I did drain him completely but unfortunately <laughs> yes it's just one one drink and I'm good uh wish you were a level two he's a murderer oh, oh man he's 2700 XP that's BS gosh you guys like some of you have some really good and you're 17 oh no I'm not gonna kill the old lady <laughs> Oh, part of me is like, yeah, I'll just kill some of these people and call it a day, but that's only 520. It's not really even worth it. Can't we? <laughs> it's going to make my life harder, though. That's the thing. Okay, three. I'm sorry, Dyson. <laughs> I feel like a bad person. No, she's not. She's not asking for it. She's a nice, sweet old lady that deserves protection. Um, but you, I'm coming for you whenever I get to level three. Okay. Man, you suck. Um, and you're level four, level one. Man, some of these people aren't even worth it. You're kind of worth it, but I just helped you. I really don't want to hurt you now. You are no good. <laughs> eh, you're a doctor. I'm not going to hurt the doctors. We need them. Can't do anything to you or you. Can't do anything to you yet. You are not worth it. You. You're another one I'm coming for. I'm not gonna hurt him. Mm. I'm not gonna hurt him either. Or her. Or her. Okay. He's the only person that is really worth killing. So. And I need to look at my boule situation. Only has two. Can I up some of these other ones? That'd be nice. Maybe I can up the revolver. I need to see how to make those. Uh, well... Uh, okay. Can I not make bullets? Well, that's kind of BS. I should be able to make them. In my opinion. Okay. Okay, so that'll up it to 70. F oh, I can choose this. So, that'll up it to 62, or decrease the reloading time by 25%, or increase damage dealt. Increase the rate of fire by 20% or mm. 
can't do anything with that yet. It's not really even worth it. I'll do this. Yeah, this is one I've already upload upgraded. That's the one I just upgraded. Man, you're so good. I just need more bullets. I wonder if I can buy some. Uh, cause you kind of suck. Yeah, you're not. I should just sell you. And you go talk to Edwina. See if I can buy some bullets. Hello. Good evening, Miss Cox. Hello again, Dr. Reed. What do you want? Hello. Can I see I want to trade with you, sell. please. As long as you have money, I'll show you all I have. Yes. Okay, we went. All of those, please. Ooh, I can buy this. Okay. Nice. Hmm. Okay. Okay, let's go ahead and save. Uh, to fight other vampires. <laughs> okay. Cloud explode after a short time, causing heavy damage. Hmm. I actually need to get an ultimate, I think. Yes. You lose control and let the beast take over for a short time. The beast teleports itself to all enemies around you and strikes them with furious blows. Create a shadow vortex at your target's feet. Coming to life, the shadows interrupt an enemy in the area and inflict tremendous damage. Nice. You focus your... <laughs> I don't know. It's a game. <laughs> you focus your power to boil your target's blood, causing it to violently explode, dealing damage to target anything nearby. 230 damage? Oh, that's 230 damage to me, I think. Okay, so. I think I kind of like this one. Close, medium range. Cost none, cost none. Uh, okay. Uh, goes all my points. Okay. So I do have an ultimate now. So that's good. Okay. Oh no. Okay, the game actually went down. I don't know if you can still hear me or not. Can you hear me? Can you hear me? Yep, okay, you can. So, the game just went down, and, um, thankfully, that saved it. <laughs> right at that moment. So, we'll just go ahead and end the stream there. Um, because it is just sitting here looking at me. <laughs> and, uh, I will... Uh, pick it up later this week or something. Uh, we'll see. But anyway, I'm going to go ahead and head off here, guys. 